So how do you calculate the perimeter of a square or a rectangle? Well, it's pretty easy. You really just need to add up the lengths of the sides. Now I visualize it as a fence. So, you know, let's pretend we've got a square fence and a rectangular fence. We just need to add up the length of all the sides and that's gonna be the perimeter. Now with a square, it's easy because all of the sides are gonna be the same length. So even if they're not all labeled, if you have one length for one side, then you know they're all gonna be the same if it's labeled as a square, because all the sides have the same length. Now, if you have a rectangle, you're gonna have two different types of length when it comes to sides. So we've got four centimeters and 10 centimeters, and the lengths opposite are gonna be the same. So those are the rules for the rectangle. Now, when answering question one, we just have to add up four and four and four and four, and that's gonna be equal to 16 centimeters, so that's the perimeter of the square. and the perimeter of the rectangle is just going to be 10 centimeters plus 4 centimeters plus 10 centimeters plus 4 centimeters and it's just going to be 28 centimeters. So you leave the unit of measure the same so whether it be meter, millimeter, wherever it might be and you just add the numbers together. That's pretty much just the basic principle of how to find the perimeter. So I hope that helped and I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have any other questions about this or something else just leave a comment down below. I'll try and get back to you in the comments or maybe I'll make a video and yeah I hope you liked it thanks for watching and appreciate you yeah getting to the end